Hello guys, I'm Sean the Bro, and I'm here today to show you probably the ultimate video game ever created. It is a retro game review for an unreleased game called Steven Seagal is the final choice. Maybe it's the final option. In fact, I don't even remember. That's how awesome it is. Um, but no, in all actuality, it's a game on Steven Seagal. How could it not be good? He's just absolutely amazing, isn't he? And uh, yeah, so let's uh, let's get to this. So what what is this? What 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 can I do there? Is that my jump? Am I dancing around? And okay, well he's dead. So uh, let's just go under this electricity because we don't want to. Uh, that did not even hit me, bro. Bro, uh, let's get out of here. How do I how do I kick this? There we go. Why is the scientist missing half his head? Now I'm stuck on something. There we go. Now he's stuck on the same thing I was. Right, kill. I don't even know if they can hurt you, but I'm gonna kill him anyway. What? Oh. <laughs> he blocks with his leg because he's so freaking cool. Right, keep going. Alright. So, uh, what, what is this? Why is he walking on top of the crates? Let's go. Take you both on at once. <laughs> They're blocking everything. Oh, I can throw knives. Look how cool this is. Gun. Now, let's say, how would you shoot... Um, how would you jump across this? Wait, I'm sorry. What was that? Is that Steven Seagal that just made that noise? Because he would not sound like that. Now, what is this? What is this? I, I, I don't understand. No, but this is actually your, uh, your spawning point. So let's, uh, let's go here. Alright. So I still don't know any of the controls. Press and random buttons. Pull out your gun. Pull out your gun. Yes. One shot. Alright. So let's go to the next screen. Terminal screen gives contact sensitive help. Press start. Alright. Wait, I'm sorry. Are these the same people that I just killed? I went to that screen so I could be ambushed by a bunch of people. Did I do something wrong? I guess I gotta go back into this, right? What? Is this the same exact thing? Alright, so deal with these people again. Not sure. Why does he die like that anyway? It's a cool death animation, but Steven Seagal, is that how Steven Seagal would do it? All fabulous and whatnot? So, obviously, instead of trying to make a jump, I'm gonna do that. There we go, and this is as far as I can go. And uh, beat this guy up, he didn't even care. <laughs> jump on the body. You're so stylish. Like, how do you jump across? And why does gravity become so much stronger when you're over that? You could probably complete the jump if you actually stayed instead of stopping in midair. Let's do this. <laughs> knives, knives, knives. Alright. Pretty interesting. Right. Oh, after minutes of planning on how to jump there. So I'm going to go across anyway. Let's uh, knife this guy right in the face. Nice. Alright, so maybe I was just doing something wrong. Let me press the other buttons before I press start. <laughs> Why are they back? They don't ever leave me alone.
Right, I'm sorry, what was that? Is that Steven Seagal? Alright, watch this. Watch how good this is. Alright. I don't understand why the scientists need to be in on it. I'm not even, they're not even deadly. Is that a big jump? the pain all right so i still don't know how to jump is that how steven seagal would do it he would put his gun away then turn around and shoot instead of just turning around because he's so boss he doesn't even want to give that guy enough credit to he has to put the gun away every time so he gives him a chance okay so learned out that scientists are satanic and they do want to kill you so, let us go to the next area. Wait, what is this, a jump? We're not gonna get past this jump. Get ready for it. Build the tension, it's important. Build the tension. Here we go. Come on, come on. I think when I was playing this, I was building a little bit too much tension. What the frick was I doing? Did I go eat a sandwich? Alright. Now, here's me trying to jump. <laughs> I wonder what that guy is thinking in front of me. Like, that I just fell off the edge and ended up behind him. I'm just trying to pull out my gun. Yep. Okay, so you can die to the other people, but you still don't lose a life when you die. I still have nine lives at the top there. Yeah. So, and then that's how you finish it. You know, I have to give credit. The Steven Seagal sprite is pretty good. I can actually see Steven Seagal looking like that in 8-bit. And that's... What does that scientist think he's going to do? Explain it to me. I think he's real cool. And I, <laughs> Right here I was trying to spawn off the edge, but it wouldn't let me. And I was too dumb to figure out that it wasn't letting me. Okay, so this is me again trying to figure out how to turn around. There we go. Nope. <laughs> yeah, I'm not the best at the controls. Don't worry, we'll get there. There we go. Okay, so let's go here. I wonder what awaits around the corner. I love how you can walk, punch, and shoot without moving his feet. Look how impressive he is. Okay, I'm sorry, is this a jump? And, um, yeah. I didn't want to make it anyway. So, it doesn't let me spawn over here. That's the platform I need to get onto. That means I have to make a jump to get there. And thus it happens again. That means I cannot complete the level because I do not know how to make that jump. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. You're going to see me die a few more times before it's over. But uh, if you enjoyed, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next episode. Goodbye, friends.